In this video, I'm going to show you how we can enable uh, conflict detection in DSCP server and Windows Server 2012. So first of all, open Windows Server 2012 Server Manager. So go to DSCP and uh, right click on it and choose DSCP Manager. In the DSCP console, you can find here the IP Weaver protocol. Right click the uh, protocol and uh, select properties. So here uh, you can go to the advanced tab and uh, here uh, you can see the explanation specify the number of time the DSCP server should attempt conflict detection for an IP test before the server leaves the address to the client. Basically, uh, it is enabled uh, so that a DSCP server will check uh, that uh, before assigning an IP test that it uh, does not uh, give a duplicate IP address to any DSCP uh, enabled client. So uh, it will ping, uh, uh, ping the IP address before uh, assigning any kind of lease to the client. So by default, it is disabled and the value that is showing is zero. You can uh, type any value between zero uh, or one to six and uh, I will type here four. Uh, so TSCP will uh, att attempt to ping uh, this, uh, uh, ping any IP that it will give uh, to avoid the conflicts. So uh, four time it will ping. If, uh, if the ping uh, uh, comes successful, then it means uh, that uh, TSCP has uh, already allocated the IP. If uh, the, uh, response is request timeout, then uh, the IP will be leased to the client. You click on apply and click on OK. So I will uh, also mention that uh, in Windows Server 2012, uh, this option is uh, applied to uh, protocol, uh, but in Windows Server 2003, uh, it is applied to server. So thanks for watching.